What's up guys? You know who it is, of course. And I'm um, joining you from my uh, bedroom today. And um, you know, I was just sitting here, you know, just chilling for a minute on my bed and I was watching, uh, you know, sorting through like some video games and DVDs and stuff and I was watching this thing um, called like, you know, the office rap party, the farewell celebration when they all went to uh, this baseball field. And, um, you know, it's just like a thing for fans, you know, it's like a wrap-up party, obviously, you know, like The Office uh, had ended. This was put up in, like, late 2013, I think, so just, you know, not too long ago, maybe about four years or four years. Um, and it was interesting, during the Q&A, one of the guys asked this question to the writer of the show. He's like, um, he's like, you know, how do you feel about, you know, your show pioneering this kind of, like, documentarian style, you know, of filmmaking and have other, how do you feel about other shows copying you? And it just kind of struck a chord with me because, like, I'm a huge, like, Trailer Park Boys fan, you know, like, and as soon as I heard that comment, I was like, w like, what do you mean The Office pioneering documentarian f film filmmaking or, or documentarian style uh, filmmaking for, like, a TV show, you know, like, like, Trailer Park Boys did that back in 1998. You know, it was 1998, 1999, the early 2000s, like the Trailer Park Boys were doing that. You know, and, and sure, that's Canadian television, right? But it's popular here in America, too. And not only that, I mean, I've watched The Office straight through, uh, you know, all seasons, and it's the same way with Trailer Park Boys. I've watched, I've watched Trailer Park Boys, I can't even count how many times I've watched Trailer Park Boys and The Office straight through, right, so many times. And... I can see so many similarities in uh, The Office, like uh, just, just moments where The Office is just like directly, directly taking from Trailer Park Boys, like even recreating, e recreating characters. Like for, for instance, like Michael Scott, like you know, my, the character of Michael Scott, like the way he mispronounces things all the time and gets things wrong and the way he's kind of dumb, but, but the way, the way Steve Carell really brilliantly plays him off is like this, this dumb character, but he plays him so, uh, he plays it, plays it as a comedic genius, right? That's Ricky from Trailer Park Boys. That's what Ricky does. Rickyisms, right? That's a, that's a famous thing on YouTube. You can look up. You know, it's like Ricky started that back in the Trailer Park Boys, and that's just one. You know, it's, if I sat here for like a, a couple minutes, like I could think of more. And I've been thinking about doing a video about this on my other channel where I, I review movies. Um, it, it's an interesting topic, really, because. The Office actually borrowed a lot from the Trailer Park Boys, and I'm not saying there's anything wrong with that, because like I said, I love The Office, but you can't make a comment like that, you know what I'm saying? You can't, um, uh, uh, you can't say that, you know, you can't be like, oh, The Office was pioneering this style of filmmaking with all these, like, unique characters and stuff like that. With the characters, maybe, obviously, yeah, a little bit more, they had some unique characters there. But the style of filmmaking, the directing, man, that was Mike Clattenburg in Canada back in the 90s. Mike Clattenburg was perfecting that stuff. Mike Clattenburg was responsible for bringing that kind of filmmaking to life, really. Uh, that, that, um, uh, it's like, you know, like Mike Clattenburg described the Trailer Park Boys, it's, it's like cops, but from a criminal's perspective. Well, that dynamic, right, plays into TV shows like The Office. It's, it's, you're seeing The Office, but from another perspective as a perspective that you wouldn't see. And look at the way he films. Look at the way he ends episodes. I'm, I'm talking about The Office now, the writers of The Office. Look at the way they end episodes of The Office. It's total Mike Clattenburg style. It's the same way Mike Clattenburg ends episodes of The Trailer Park Boys. It's the exact same way, the filming style, how everything is executed, the way the characters act even sometimes. Um, so yeah, you know, I just wanted to like, you know, I was just sitting here and I just wanted to turn on my camera real, real quick and just kind of like, you know, make this video, see what you guys thought about that too, is that, you know, even though it, as good as The Office is, and perhaps maybe The Office did pioneer it for American uh, filmmaking, The Office did borrow a lot from the Trailer Park Boys and you can't argue that and obviously Trailer Park Boys was around first. Um, so, I just wanted to kind of, you know, like, get those, uh, get those thoughts out there to you guys. So, you know, what do you guys think? Leave, leave all your thoughts down below, of course, on that. Uh, let me know what you guys think. And I'll, uh, I'll see you back for the next video, the next vlog very soon. Later.